Good evening. My name is Bernard Khan. I am an engineer, mathematician, and a business owner. I own a couple of commercial buildings here in Cedar Flow. So this is my home, my place. I am here to support human rights movement. I'm not a politician, and I don't join any of those parties, political party parties or current party. I stand here before you, sir, ma'am, to ask you not to welcome this human rights criminal to our place called home, Lowo. As the Cambodian people have suffered long enough, more than you could imagine. So please stop here. This movement is just the beginning of the Cambodian American in law. And I'm surprised that the CMAA will not support this movement, the civil rights. We have like the first Cambodian representative to represent this small district. But he acting as the federal government reach out to this human rights criminal from Cambodia. What is his political gains here? What is the District 18 stand for? We as an engineer, we build homes, bridge, great jobs. He is the politician, maybe perhaps build the eagle. The past 30 years, Cambodia is the democratic country, but yet still the most corrupted country on earth. Any constructive criticism towards the government is prohibited. Democracy is just the word to be heard. And most people live in fear, wondering when they last. Hun's family created the gang called his brother and sister. If we reflect in the Khmer group, when they brainwashed young children to kill their parents, this is exactly like that. The European community has stopped foreign aid to Cambodia until the human rights respected. I wonder when the United States will follow. Can we begin it here? If you welcome him to low, just like you bring a Trojan horse to this community, where the Cambodian people, Cambodian American, call this place as their home, where they enjoy the freedom freedom of everything, to grow, to raise the children, and to have a free speech. Their life now will be at risk because there will be so many spies here throughout the Sea of Low, planted by this criminal family. If this is your political game, sir, ma'am, to put our people's life at risk, then you are nothing but a criminal too. Your action need to be stopped here. Keep in mind, if Cambodia is safe like the United States today, I guarantee you that every one of us will leave this country in a heartbeat. But that's not the case. As of tonight, because of your decision to welcome him, my family and I are fear of our life. So I'm sure the rest of the people here Because their spy will know who we are, what we do, or what we say, just like the gentleman before me stated, that will be killed, you know, either here or during their visit back home. So if that's the case, every life that's being killed, up to today onward, I will, and all the community call, will hold this city council accountable for. During the Vietnam War, Cambodia got the most bombs on earth. And yet our people, include my grandparents, stand with the American people and save a lot of American lives. Today, I am on behalf of my grandparents, asking you, the city, that favor back to stand with us, not to welcome this criminal to our city. Thank you.